You can create multiple sites for different aspects of your life. For example, you could create one like this for your family to use and share. You could create another for a sports team that you or your child is on. If you own a business, you could create another Google site for that. If you love sharing recipes with your friends, you could set up a Google site where you could all share your favorite meals that you've created. These are all Google sites. There are no limits to how many Google sites you can create. You'll always be able to find them here under the My Sites section. You'll see a list of your sites and you can easily begin to create a new one right from here. If you have a lot of sites, you can search for content in the search box. If you're looking for content in a broader search, you can choose to search all Google sites, meaning you can search any Google site in the world that has been made public. This opens up a whole new area of searching for content because it will all be from Google Sites. There's one more setting to check out, which is for all of your sites. It's located under User Settings, and this allows you to choose a language, a time zone, and if you want to be notified via email of your own changes, which I don't, and just save your changes. Thanks for watching, and don't miss the first nine episodes in the Sharing Online with Google Sites series.